Hi, I'm Charo. Watch Marvel make me a hero. I always wanted to be a writer, and then when I started college, one of my classes was a seminar, and every week we had to go to the newspaper. And once I went into that newsroom, I knew that that was it. <laughs> I was a goner. I'm born and raised in Puerto Rico. When I moved here four years ago, I started to understand better representation and understand what those intersections of my identity actually mean. And I've always been kind of a storyteller. So for me, journalism as a vehicle to tell those stories and to elevate those voices is a very, very powerful thing. Most recently, we went to see Spider-Verse and my universes collided because Miles Morales' mom speaks Spanish and she's Puerto Rican. And seeing somebody like me and somebody like Miles who shares my culture and shares my identity is something so powerful and it goes back to the representation and that is truly a superpower. Because I come from a family of educators and the work that I do is training, for me the, the most powerful thing I do and I get to do is understand kind of what other people's problems are and then help them how to figure them out themselves. I think magic would just be like a cool thing to be able to have. Change is very hard, so working in an environment where you are the person who is kind of fostering change and leading change or being an agent of change is hard. And that's kind of where like a little bit of magic, a little bit of empathy and some cookies help. I'd like my hero to look like me. I'm 5'10", so I'm quite tall. I've always had long black hair. Obviously, I'm Puerto Rican, and I'm a brown Puerto Rican, so I'd like her to be brown. I usually do red lips, and I feel that that's my war paint. And that's a thing that I feel that my words are more powerful. Her outfit, I would like it to be black because I wear a lot of black. And I like gold just for her to have a little, you know, a little shine, a little shimmer. I think I would have my secret identity in the newsroom so people don't know, and then would go out to the street, maybe to help find stories, and then I'd be my superhero identity there. But I don't know that I would tell people in the newsroom that I'm that superhero too. I love her. Oh, she's so cute. I love her hair. She has a magical cookie on her shoulder. That is amazing. I love the detail in the chest plate of the green and the red flowers. I love the gold details on the legs and the arms and the hands, those gloves. Like she has a magical cookie on her shoulder. It's like a glowing cookie. Um, cookies can't live outside of Puerto Rico, so I'm a cookie in New York. So I love that she has a cookie. Thanks, Marvel, for making me a hero.